Hello, this is John again, coming at you with the Ford Maverick Lariat Hybrid. And what I wanted to do is kind of show the secret menu, at least for the Lariat version of the Maverick. I know this will work for the FX4 um, XLT as well, because it has a screen. I don't know if it'll work for the XL or XLTs with a smaller screen, but you can always try it. So what you do in order to get to the secret screen is your first one to hit the OK button on the steering wheel, press and hold it, and then at the same time, as you're pressing and holding it, push the start-stop button just once without holding the brake. Now, once you see ET show up in the message center there, you can go ahead and let go of the OK button. Now you're an engineer and testimony. Now I'm going to start up the truck as well there we go I got my air conditioner on because it is about 83 degrees outside so we got the air conditioner on and what I wanted to show you is this um, we can use this right here to go up and down so let's do that right now look at that analog gauge test right there color LED test some important stuff. Vehicle speed and tachometer, which is very important. Many have complained that they do not get a tach in the hybrid, but this right here in the engineering test mode shows a tachometer for the engine. Um, and then we should see it start up here soon since my air conditioner on it pulls power from the high voltage battery. And when the battery gets below a certain percentage, it will actually fire up the engine and help charge that battery back up. So we'll look at that here in a little bit. Instant fuel. Um, this is instant fuel economy. Cold temperature, 91 to, 90 degrees Celsius, which is relative to four bars. So if somebody wants to do conversion on that for a Fahrenheit, so four bars is right around 90 degrees Celsius. If someone wants to do that, it's about 83 degrees outside. Uh, that'd be great. This will give you the cooling temperature, uh, trip odometer as well in kilometers and miles, uh, fuel according to the trip, battery voltage 14.8 volts, compass, last chime, second chime, all kinds of good stuff. All right, engineering test mode. Let's go back to the port engaged that I wanted to show today. And that is this one right here. Now, right, right now, the engine has not kicked on. I can make it kick on. Let's see if I can do that right now. All right. So right now, the engine is idling at 1260 RPMs. And from what I found when I've done this multiple times, this is where the engine would idle all the time. Right around this RPM. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop it in sport mode. And we're gonna go for a drive. And here in a little bit, I'll go full throttle, let you see what that looks like. See what the RPMs kind of tap out at on this 2.5 liter hybrid. do that well can't do that now I got some people ahead of me but still in sport mode we'll make sure to get a video of what it looks like at just cruising and normal at whatever speed I'm at currently um, yeah so let me just uh, Kind of slow down here okay you can see where the engine kind of idles at and this is right now i don't have i mean i have don't have it in normal so it's not going to go in electric mode if it's in sport it will always keep the engine on so but we're about to get in a full throttle here and i'll let you see what it looks like when we go into full throttle 
uh, here in about a few seconds here. There we go. Hope you saw that. Had to get around some big earth moving trucks. So, but that was full throttle. I'm going to put it back in normal. And now it shuts the engine off. As you can see where the engine RPMs are, cruising at about 60 miles an hour. And then we'll also show a uh, kind of a shot of the tack, or not the tack, but we are looking at the tack. We'll kind of show a shot of the water uh, temperature as well in the engine. Again, 2.5 liter hybrid, Lariat, in engineering test mode with the engine RPMs. You can see the tack and relative to the power display to kind of dictate roughly, you know, if it's at this certain power, this is what it will do. Um, kind of, but anyway, bear with me as I go around this corner. Go ahead and check out that water temperature. Drop down to oh, was that three bars? Now it's at four. So cold temperature cool down to about oh, that's still roughly around yeah, 90 degrees Celsius. Anyway, there we go. 92. Not, I've seen this go as high as 95 degrees Celsius and that's kind of where it tops out at. I wouldn't say nothing higher than that. But anyway, there we go. Uh, 96 degrees Celsius. So This engine doesn't really run that warm, even if it's warm outside with the air conditioner on. So, Alright, well you guys be blessed. Have a wonderful day and stay tuned for more Maverick content. It gets uploaded every Wednesday. Awesome. Thank you, guys.